So this is uh, the last part of the first Orland in a Boeing 77 level D simulator. And I just wanted to show you how autopilot lands the plane. So what this does to the last bit of the flight. And we will be able to see how much the autopilot and it lands perfectly smooth, how much that moves the controls back. You can see this line here, it's different colors on these two parts. So yeah, my friend is moving the, the camera a lot, but you can at least get a feel how, how much it moves moves the controls. So let's go. And now we use the Cat 1 minimums. Yes, it doesn't matter because we're BMC, but yeah. Otherwise we could have, could have had the... So, I'm holding in the yoke, but it's the it's autopilot that lands the plane. So I'm not flying at this moment. I'm just holding there. So at 50, the autopilot starts to move the controls back. And you can see the amount it moves it back. I would estimate between five and 10 centimeters. This is three thumbs, so it's about nine centimeters. Uh, three inches, I mean three inches. So it's about the thickness of the control column is about nine, uh, nine centimeters. Um, so this was at 50. Let's go back and look at that again. So there we have it. So when you, uh, so my pilot friend said, and my captain friend sa said to me that you should flare at 20 feet, but the autopilot actually do it at 50, as you can see. And So there we have it.